10 Best Military and Police Dog Breeds What do you get when you have a loving, loyal, trustworthy and intelligent creature? How about a great partner who'd be perfect for fighting crime, but the only thing it needs is proper and constant training and can be sure that it'll never let you down? That sounds too good to be true for every species, except when it comes to dogs. Some breeds of canine combine so well their best attributes that the law enforcement groups such as police force, military, airport security, firefighters, search and rescue and many more groups are common to have several of these partners as their loyal helpers, confident that they'll get the job done. Welcome to Dog Law. Today, we're taking a look at the 10 best breeds of dogs used in the military, police and other law enforcement forces. There can be a variety of breeds that can fit the task because this depends on what we're talking about. Certain breeds are used for controlling the public order, others are used for tracking narcotics and other illicit substances, as well as tracking people. Before we start on our list, can you guess which was the first breed of dog ever used to serve alongside the police enforcement? Comment below, stay tuned and at the end we'll see if you guessed it right. As always, remember to like this video and subscribe to the channel to keep you updated on the most recent content. And without further ado, we kick off our list with number 10. Beagles This might come as a surprise, but the Beagle's nose represents one of the best in the business. His portable small size makes you think these dogs are only fit for playing around the house or playing catch outside. But actually, Beagles are often used as detection dogs, having their very own Beagle Brigade that's part of the United States Department of Agriculture's Animal and Plant Health Inspection Service, or APHIS. There, they're in charge of luggage inspection searching for agricultural items or products and have an average of 75,000 prohibited items discovered in luggage a year. Beagle's sense of smell is so powerful that the Beagle Brigade also works alongside the Public Health Service and the US Customs and Border Protection and can be found in border zones and narcotic finding patrol dogs. There they perform the task of finding fruit and vegetables that could carry pests and be able to infect the US harvest. They also are very good at detecting unauthorized meat, having an amazing success rate of 90%. In 1984, the APHIS program was inaugurated at Los Angeles International Airport and after 20 years, there are more than 60 Beagle Brigade teams at 21 international airports. They are so useful for their ability to distinguish different smells, categorizing restricted products like meats, fruit and vegetables from non-restricted products. They are able to recognize more than 50 different smells and scents. Number 9. Labrador Retriever I hope you won't be annoyed when we include the Labrador Retriever in nearly all our lists when it comes to good, obedient and loyal dogs. Properly following his nose, listening to commands, it's normal to watch a Labrador Retriever in an airport or in the field assisting the law enforcement. Police use many dog breeds for different reasons and often use Labradors for their exceptionally great sense of smell. They were bred to smell toys and retrieve them from the yard. But now they sniff out narcotics, weapons, explosives or even people. Very similar to beagles, Labradors are usually seen in airports, border zones or other centres of transportation where there's a lot of traffic. There have been many stories of Labradors finding large numbers of people below the wreckage after an earthquake. Keep in mind, not all Labradors are destined to be working alongside the police force, but not all heroes work in the police, as Labradors are oftentimes seen as therapy and service dogs. Number 8. Bouvier de Flandre Imagine a big guard dog used in World War I as a battleground dog, carrying messages and pulling ambulance litters and supply carts in the battlefield. This is why the dog that's taking number 8 in our list is the Bouvier de Flandre, a big guard dog originally from Belgium. They might look like teddy bears and sure act lovingly to their partners, but don't let their curly hair fool you. Once they pick up some things off, they can be very intimidating after a loud growl. Their powerful sense of smell makes them ideal to be lined up as police working dogs and their experience being bred as aid dogs in World War I suits them perfectly when they're needed for a search and rescue task. Their high energy and great physique means they need to exercise and hunt and this urge is satisfied when a Bouvier is trained with the police. Because they motivate with learning, activities and human interaction, the training that the police can provide for them makes them perfect for the job. Number 7. Airedale Terrier A little history before breaking down our number 7. It's 1910 in Scotland and the first canines to be presented in the police force are introduced. Rather than the Labradors or the Shepherds, they are the Airedale Terriers. 
These dogs assisted officers on the night shift and sniff out burglars lying in wait in the city's parks. They are also trained to track down criminals in Glasgow. The Airedale Terrier is the largest and hardiest of the terriers and a useful dog. In addition to their service in Scotland, this breed served Great Britain in World War I, performing all types of tasks, such as carrying military supplies in the battlefield and scouting. They also transported mail, found wounded soldiers on the battlefield, and carried messages to soldiers behind enemy lines. In addition to their powerful sense of smell, tough, wiry coats, and overall intelligence, Airedale Terriers were good candidates to serve in the British police force because they were easy to maintain. Number 6. Bloodhound When people think about dogs in law enforcement, it's more common to think about a dog with the speed and agility of a German Shepherd. But at number 6 on our list, it's the Bloodhound, who undoubtedly owns the best nose of all canines. Of course, bloodhounds are part of police squads, border patrols, and search and rescue groups for their near-perfect nose, which can track down virtually anything with an impeccably low margin of error. Bloodhounds are not common today, but they really are an old-school type of police dog. They've been around for quite a while, with records tracking them down thousands of years. The bloodhound breed originated in Europe as early as the 7th century. The dogs were used for hunting, but have also worked with police for hundreds of years, tracking fugitives and missing persons. This breed of dog was chosen for one reason. While other dogs could track a person down for days after sniffing, the bloodhound manages to track the person or the object for weeks after they were missing. Remember when we said if you could guess what breed of dog was the first one to join policemen to their everyday work? Well, the bloodhounds took that prize in 1889 when they were trained to help the police in England track down Jack the Ripper. Before we reach halfway, can you guess which is the most important attribute of a police dog? Could it be their nose or their speed and agility to take down criminals? Let us know in the comments. Number 5. Dutch Shepherd A breed that shares the same ancestry with the German Shepherd and the Belgian Malinois that was diverged only 100 years ago. The Dutch Shepherd is a rarer breed that's not seen as often as its distinct cousins. However, they are one of the easiest to train and healthiest breeds there are. The thing about Dutch Shepherds is that they are one of the breeds that enjoy learning the most. This, combined with their urge to please their owners, make them just right for receiving specific orders from different police enforcements. This is why, while labs and beagles can be found in airports or border patrols, Dutch Shepherds are seen more often alongside the police, working as patrol dogs or on the battlefield with the military. Their acute sense of smell qualifies them as a selective breed to work for the task including odour detection from explosives and narcotics, as well as human tracking. But their nose isn't the only tool these dogs use when they're serving alongside the police force and the military. Their impressive speed, stamina and agility can be useful for human apprehension in different police and military operatives. Number 4. Doberman Pinscher Besides the breeds that are sitting in the first spots on our list, one breed of a police dog that's usually seen on TV is the Doberman Pinscher. This intimidating-looking breed has been working with the police for many decades. While they're not as often used as other dogs on the list like Dutch Shepherds or Labradors, Doberman Pinschers use their speed and stamina to apprehend fleeing criminals by grabbing them by the arm and pulling them to the ground. The reason they're not used as much as other breeds is because they're not trained for sniffing, but for their ability to take down criminals with little difficulty, using their physically fit, athletic and fast-moving bodies. Dobermans are one of the fastest breeds of dog with very few breeds of police dogs that can outrun them especially when they're chasing a fleeing suspect. They are the best at this specific task, which is why they take the number four spot on our list. We have a surprising history involving a breed of dog who served in the military that weighs less than seven pounds. We'll tell you the story near the end of this video. Number three, Rottweilers. Serving as guard dogs, search and rescue, police and military dogs, it's not surprising that Rottweilers take the number three spot on our list. Rottweilers rank in the top 10 breeds for canine intelligence on every list we found. Known for their bravery, perception and loyalty, it makes sense that when properly trained, they're an ideal breed to work next to any law enforcement group. Some police investigations can have Rottweilers on the go, meaning keeping the dog working until the investigation is complete. It was this stamina that helps Rottweilers carry urgent messages for the military in both world wars. Similar to Dobermans, Rottweilers are capable of apprehending a suspect by pulling down their arm and taking them down to the floor. This should not be a surprise, because the amazing strength a Rottweiler owns in its body is no secret to anyone. That's why Rottweilers are seen both in search and rescue and in the military overseas. Number 2. Belgian Malinois 
Belgian Malinois is the close and smaller cousin of the German Shepherd, and for years Belgians have been confused for German Shepherds because of the similar appearances and outstanding performances in the police, search and rescue, and military groups. Belgian Malinois are bred to sniff out bombs and narcotics in airports and bring down criminals to the ground, even though they're not as aggressive by nature. However, this is accomplished because they are very easygoing when they're trained. So, when a Belgian Malinois chases and apprehends suspects, he does it more after a trained task rather than opportunity to be aggressive. Belgian Malinois are so effective for police and military operations that various dogs of this breed have been pivotal to several crucial military operations. In Syria, one Belgian Malinois performed the task of running in an underground tunnel that was vital for the takedown of terrorist Abu Bakr al baghdadi Another operation involved a Belgian Malinois named Cairo that was working alongside the SEAL Team 6 and was crucial to the taking down of Osama bin Laden. Before we reveal our top pick, here's a surprising story about a dog who did his part during the war. A Yorkshire Terrier named Smokey protected his human troop pack during World War II by pulling urgently needed telegraph wires through a really scary, partially destroyed 70-foot pipe that ran under an airfield exposed to enemy fire. This shows that sometimes you need a little dog to get you out of a tight spot. And number one, German Shepherds. With the least surprising spot on our list, the German Shepherd takes the spotlight as the perfect breed for all kinds of security-related tasks. First of all, they're agile, strong, and easy to train for scout dog duty. But a very important detail is that they're not overly aggressive and therefore can remain calm in hostile locations and situations. Their acute smell is ideal for search and rescue, tracking missing people or objects, and detecting narcotics. This qualifies them to be working in search and rescue groups. When they're not busy using their impressive noses, they're using their speed and stamina chasing down criminal suspects and using their strength to make them lose their balance and fall to the ground. So we can check patrol dog duties as well. Finally, their loyal and predictable personality makes for a dependable wingman when one of these guys is by your side in a battlefield. Few breeds are up to as many service dog tasks as German Shepherds. Well, there you have it. What did you think about our top 10? Did we miss anything? Let us know and as always remember to comment on what topic you want us to discuss next. See you in the next video guys!